Hello, this is Justin with your December 6th update on Lauren's recovery process. So this past week they have established an estimated discharge date for her to finish her inpatient rehab portion of her recovery here at Shepherd Center. And that estimated discharge date is January 12th. So virtually about five more weeks of rehab and then uh, they will get everybody ready to go. I'll come down for the last week to do some family training. In the meantime, I will go home for a few weeks to be with the kids and to get some stuff taken care of around the house and with the business. So at this point, they are really ramping up Lauren's rehab schedule. She's doing a lot more. She's getting stronger. She is days away from her trach coming completely out. On Friday, the ENT took a scope down there, said everything's clear. So now we just need the pulmonology team to sign off on the removal of that trach. It may weaken her voice for a few days while she recovers, but in the long run, she'll be ready to go and she'll, she keeps working with the speech language therapy team to get that voice stronger, to help her breathing, and just to get that portion of her rehab squared away. Um, they're doing things with her this week that are a little different, they're adding different things to the schedule. Uh, on Wednesday, she is scheduled to go with a few other patients over to Target for her first field trip in her wheelchair. So she's gonna do her best not to knock over her stuff off the shelves. <laughs> if she does, who cares? Who cares? There's people there to pick it up, but she won't. She'll be fine. She's getting a lot better driving her wheelchair. She has been getting higher up on the tilt table when they put her on that every week. Um, they've been doing some casting on her feet uh, just to make sure that they stay the right angle and they don't end up going like this so that when she does walk again, she can have the full mobility with her feet. They are doing some more strengthening things. Actually, last week she was on her stomach in a prone position for the first time. She said that felt great. So as she gets more accustomed to that, then they might actually have her sleep on her stomach and that'll help just strengthen different parts of her body. So it's just a lot of strengthening and stretching and keeping things loose, figuring out the, the, the best strategy for her with her medicine and things like that. What's up, buddy? Uh, one of the patients just popped by, Bobby. Great guy, He's very supportive of Lauren. So yeah, at this point, I'm gonna stick around for a little bit longer and then I'm gonna go home and check those kids out and give uh, Lauren's brother Rob a, a nice break. He's been unbelievable the last five weeks, staying at his parents' house and, and basically raising these kids. So he needs a break, he needs to go back to New York and get some uh, some R&R. &R. Those kids are definitely uh, <laughs> keeping him on his toes. So yeah, at this point, she's just gonna keep on with her schedule and she really feels very, very comfortable at Shepherd. She's really getting to know all the team members for her, from her therapy team. And then we have the same cycle of nurses that come through each week, during the week, and then over the weekend, daytime and nighttime, she's really starting to strike up good relationships with those nurses and their assistants and things like that. So she feels very comfortable here. And you know, this is her chance to get to the point where she can become more independent. Obviously, she it's gonna be hard for her when I'm not here. It's gonna be hard for me not being here, but this is just part of the process. And just imagine when I come back in a few weeks, how far she will have come. So that's the update on December 6th. Um, I'll show you a little clip of some of the stuff they're doing at our house right now, and then a couple other clips here at the end. But thanks everybody for your support and your love and all your prayers. We love you all. Lauren loves you all. We'll talk to y'all next week. That role is a new thing, a new addition to the repertoire. Oh, Ozzy, you're doing the fish. <laughs>